Hey guys, Barry here and welcome back to IGS and welcome to Last Encounter on the Nintendo Switch. Massive thank you to Celestia Games for this exclusive early hands-on. Okay, so this is like a rogue, uh, a rogue shooter. Let's see here. That's actually a pretty cool looking uh, gamepad, I must say. <laughs> I guess we'll wing it. Uh, single player will do. Bend in space time. Okay, interesting. A well hidden and secured scientific research center has just finished the Project Gilgamesh. It would grant humanity an incredible new possibility. By copying and transferring the personality, scientists led by Dr. Daniel Connor would grant humankind a new life. An eternal life. And then, disaster struck. Sudden surge of energy in Jupiter's orbit left open a space-time wormhole. Through it came a vast fleet of ships of unknown origin. The Dark Ones attacked. The first contact with an alien species proved to be a run-in with the end for the humankind. In a mere days, humanity was annihilated. Its resources stripped. Dozens of millennia of human history, gone. One hidden outpost survived. The scientists were able to replicate a one-way interstellar portal. Site's security force was sent in it to try and close the Jupiter wormhole from the inside. They never returned, and Jupiter Portal is still open. It is up to you to investigate what happened to the fleet and try to accomplish their mission. With the help of Dr. Daniel Connor, you are able to reboot your existence, and retry until you succeed. Good luck. Okay, so we here, here we have Dr. Daniel Connor. Subject 12A, hey, are you there? Can you hear me? Can he hear me? What's going on? Can you hear? Oh, you can. Good. Good. Okay. This is the deal, Chief. We don't have much time left before the next scheduled rotation, so listen well. You're about to go on a secret mission. It's crucial for humanity's preservation. Don't worry. I and my staff will help you along in any way we can. Do you understand? Good. The first thing you'll need to do is choose from these synthetic bodies we've engineered for the mission. Their capabilities vary, of course, so try and find one that best suits your style. Okay, so... 15% up, you know, fire rate and shield, but down 15% speed. Health? Give this guy a go? I don't know. Next thing. You'll have to do, uh, you'll have to do is choose a ship all ships are equipped with uh, and share the same basic technology. There are small variations to best suit your combat style, so choose the one you're most comfortable with. Okay, here we have. Let's see. Maybe that one. I don't know, give it a go. Great. Looks like you're all set. Nothing else you need to know about all of this. Let's go. You're ready, so head through the portal just outside the station. Okay, so... Yeah, use left stick to go. You can change pilot and change ship. Use right stick to aim. Oh, this is cool. <laughs> so you can buy stuff there.
Let's go. That was cool looking. Yeah, so as you can see, it's all randomly generated. Well, this is awkward. This is not the place you were supposed to end up in. Let me just check something real quick. It seems the security system threw you into the training area, probably because it detected that you have zero flying ho uh, hours. Sorry, <laughs> I was going to say horse for some reason. Oh well, might as well get this out of the way then. Find a key for the portal and return here as soon as you can. Well, this should at least be somewhat, what is it, intrinsic. Your ship is equipped with, like, the coolest weapon. It's one of my personal creations, if I may add. And as such, it can easily blow up those, um, floating rock things. Hmm. Okay, so if it's the red things, it does not do any damage, okay. One of the core creatures, features even, <laughs> of my ships is the ability to quickly utilize different weapon parts you might find throughout the galaxy. <clears throat> that weapon component over there is a perfect example. Go ahead and use it. Cool. Remember that you can always switch the weapon configuration, even in flight. It literally took me weeks to implement this feature, so you know, use it. Nice one. Sector clear. I'm sorry, but the key you're looking for is in another castle. Fun right? Don't worry, love that Mario reference. Don't worry buddy, your ship is equipped with a jump drive. There's another sector nearby. See if you can find the key there. Okay, let's go. Oh, wow. Now for the cool stuff, each of my ships is equipped with a special ability, so try it out. You need it soon. That bloody... Okay, so we got our first key. Nice one. Do we, uh... Portal to base, fair enough. So we have 37 uh, gold coins. Should be it now, hopefully. We'll see what happens. T 
Take it all in, subject. The Dark Galaxy, home to the Life Enders. Mindless, power hungry, warm, uh, warmongers, is it? But no respect for life. They took everything from us, and yet we still don't understand or know anything about them. Oh, that's cool. Look at that. Nice, at least we got him anyway. Deadly. Just want to check something before we go. Oh. Let's warp to another place here. Oh, God. Oh crap, my own fault. Dead. <laughs> That's pretty fun. Let's try again. Okay. Fair enough. Nice one. Oh crap.
That's me gone. I should have got. It's my fault. Let's go back to base. So, guys, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this. There was like the first 15 minutes of the game in action. Last encounter. That's pretty fun. Subject 12A01. Welcome back. I know you have a lot of questions. I understand, but I can't go into all details. All the details now. Everything will be explained in time. You have to trust me for now. I mean, it's not like you have a choice. Again, like before, just choose a body that best suits your needs and then choose a ship. Try and balance their statements, a their statistics a bit. Their statistics, I even say it a bit. Take it into account what you've encountered so far. Yeah, a massive thank you to uh, Celestia Games for this early hands-on. This game is out very soon on the Switch eShop. You can, of course, check us out on YouTube, Twitter, and Instagram, and for more on Nintendo and Indies, right here at IGS. Alright guys, see you soon.